Hey everyone, what's up? My name is Jessica Whitaker. I'm a photographer from Seattle, Washington. Today's video is a behind the scenes shoot about how I'm getting portraits in direct sunlight. It's super cute. It's very country, country boy, shake it for me. We're gonna be shooting in a really cool field of daisies or at least it will look like a field. I'm shooting with my Canon 5D Mark IV and then my Sigma Art 35 lens today. Be sure to check out the full set of images over on my website. It'll be linked down below. Today's video is sponsored by Skillshare. If you guys are not already aware, uh, Skillshare is an amazing amazing online community of over 15,000 classes specifically targeted towards creatives. I've actually worked with Skillshare in the past, so if you haven't seen that video, I talk more in depth about it, about the website itself, about my favorite classes that I've taken personally, so you can check out that video in the description box below. What's awesome about Skillshare is that everyone can take a class, do a project, or even teach a class themselves. Premium membership starts at about $10 a month, which gives you unlimited access to all of their learning resources, so that's like basically half of a Starbucks drink for an entire month of knowledge. You can learn from anywhere. So they have an app that you can download onto your Android or iPhone device, which gives you access to offline learning too. My favorite class that I've taken is one on digital media marketing. So it's not just, oh, photography, calligraphy. You're gonna be able to find classes such as marketing, how to do finance stuff for your business. It's just, it's very, it's, it's helpful for creatives. It's taught by creatives. So thank you so much to Skillshare for sponsoring this video and let's get started. Okay, so I really like how the light is right now. It's completely 100% direct sunlight. It makes her blue eyes really pop. And also it's nice because there isn't anything, like any buildings that are coming through and making unnatural shadows. The only thing that's gonna create shadow is obviously if I'm kind of, my body shadow is in the way or her own features. So it's really nice and ideal to shoot in this kind of direct sunlight. Okay, so we're just gonna start with a couple portraits right now. I'm on, um, my f-stop is 1.4. My shutter speed is 8,000 and then my ISO so it's 100. I think that these settings are kind of wrong, but like it's fine. It will make a good Instagram anyway. So I'm going to have you, because we're shooting in this harsh light, make sure to really keep your face up and um, whenever we do the side, really like accentuate the jaw. So have you now bring both your hands up and let's start kind of playing with your hair. Oh, that's really cute. And you can even kind of fluff it outwards. Yeah, cute. Wait, that's so cute. I love that. I love, how about have your other hand back up here by your shoulder? Cute. And then with the other hand, I'll have you play with your hair. We're gonna keep playing with your hair. With your wrist though, make sure to not have it flat, have it kind of turned in a little bit. Oh, sorry, the one that's on your chest right here. Yep, perfect. So then we can see your nails. So cute. I love that. Okay, so I'll have you put that one in your hair again, but we'll just do a bunch of like pretend. Make sure the flower's pointing out so we get it in the camera. It's not covered by the fingers. And just be really big, really big smiles. Cute, look down. That's cute. With that hand that's holding the other two, slide it down just a little bit so you can see. Yeah, cute. And look off to the side, look to the other side. Cute. Oh my gosh, wait, the lashes look amazing. <laughs> I'm gonna do a really wide shot of your whole body and then the daisies. And in this, I'm going to shoot through a daisy. Maybe it will create something. Maybe it will look like trash. We'll just see. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to have you though, kind of turn and swing your legs towards the uh, raspberry bushes. Don't get cut. Yeah, just like hold the flowers, look around, move both of your hands because I love those sleeves. And so we can, yeah, beautiful. Maybe bring them both to the side of you. Yeah. And you can kind of like gather the flowers. Cute. Look up at me and smile big. Wait, this is so cute. Oh my gosh. Wait, this is adorable. You, yeah, yeah, I'll just have you make sure you're moving, moving both hands at the same time. Yeah, you're just doing different things. Yeah, that's cute. Look up at me and smile big and you even lean forward and do a little laugh for me. Yeah, cute, cute. Okay, so we're out here in the woods. Look at how cute that is. Can you zoom in? Make it ratchet though, so it's funny. Do you see what I'm talking about? Yes. Okay. Hey. Okay, let's go over there. Okay, so um, I'm having Riley stand on this side of this uh, art installation. Uh, when you can't even say art installation, right? When you try to be cultured, because I like how it's a little bit, this has so much going on and I like that it balances her out 
it's not gonna add like if I put her right here it'd be kind of too much she get lost within the blackberry bushes so I feel like putting her on this side where it's a little bit more calm really like evens it out makes it look more aesthetically pleasing makes me look like I kind of know what I'm doing this is really good we're smart dang okay I love it oh the wind is so good okay so we're gonna work with the wind right now Vogue be like okay <sighs> Cute. Wait, that's so cute. Something that I like to do whenever I have people doing a lot of like laughing shots um, is to have them kind of lean forward a little bit, even if it's just like leaning with their collarbones in. Because when you laugh, typically, at least for most human beings, you don't go like ha ha ha, like stiff. You're moving with your body because you're like having, you're going through like an ab cardio workout. So I don't know if any of that makes sense. Um, so yeah, I usually, whenever I have people laugh, I tell them kind of bring your shoulders in um, or kind of lean forward just because it looks a lot more natural and not so like they're forced to laugh at my jokes. Okay, so I'm gonna have you do that. So instead of kind of being straight, have you kind of bring your, almost lead with your collarbones. Yeah, cute. Perfect. That's so cute. Actually, if you turn all the way to the side. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. And then your back leg is gonna be slightly in front. And then with both your hands, kind of kick your skirt back and you're just gonna kind of look down at that, um, at that toe. Yeah, cute. The last thing for our shoot is I'm gonna do some backlit portraits with my 35, um, just because we just did a ton of wide angle stuff and I wanna get some close ups for that blog post. Okay, yeah, just big smiles and keep your face really high. Actually, bring it down, never mind. It's okay, like, that's so cute. Bring your hands into it though, because it's very close up. Yeah, and bring your other hand up too. Beautiful and smile big. Careful though with the hair. Okay, this is a tip too. Um, make sure never to kind of either pull it down because it's gonna kind of create a flat shape or to press it. So you kind of want to fluff it um, and always do more of the tips of your hair. If you're gonna go up here, then make sure that you're not kind of creating a weird shape by pressing it up, that you're almost like tapping the top of it. I hope that makes sense. Wisdom. <laughs> I'm very wise. Solomon? No, my name is Jessica. <laughs> so cute. Beautiful. Amazing. Respect her. Yes. Alright everyone, so that was it. That was the video. I hope that you enjoyed. I hope that you learned something. I hope that you're hyped about Skillshare. Thank you again to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Be sure you subscribe to this channel for more photography and social media videos. You can find me over on Instagram at Jessica Whitaker and at Twitter at Jessica Lee 206 Again, if you haven't already, check out the full set of images from this session on my website. Okay, so uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.